guys welcome back to my channel netflix just grouped like four episodes in one you know me i'm just gonna do individual episodes this is i guess part one of four. Oh, last episode was a play and it was cute but now we're i think in the action so i'm ready for this journey it's 1 15 a.m right now this is an hour and a half so i will see you guys at three i hope i don't cry all right so this is comment part one the phoenix king now let me hear you roar like a tiger dillo a tiger dillo how long until this comment because i kind of agree with zuko uh, but then it's like at the same time i'm so lazy too all right oh the bear wow how can you sit around having beach parties when Sozin's Comet is only three days away? Three? Three days? Why are you They're all looking at me bugging. like I'm crazy? It was what I dreamed about and wanted for so many years. My father had finally accepted me back. After this meeting is when he decided to leave. The people of the Earth Kingdom are proud and strong. They can endure anything as long as they have hope. I think you should take their precious hope and the rest of their land and burn it all to the ground. Yes. That's like the last city too that is really standing. Aside from that little North Pole. The Lord Sozin used it to wipe out the air nomads. Now I will use its power to end the Earth Kingdom. Permanently. So he wants everyone to be fire? Like, what if you need little bit of earthbender a world in which all the lands are fire nation and i am the supreme ruler of everything i understand that he wants to be ruler of everything but i think i really think he's not thinking this through i feel like it would just make your life so much easier if you had different types of elements still alive you could still control them but you'd have to wipe them out because then no one's gonna earthbend ever again like what if you need to move something really strong or like shape land or something there's one technique you need to know before facing my father how to redirect lightning wow. if you let the energy i didn't feel like myself there that's how it's done <laughs> he's so cute i feel so bad for him he can't do it Sleepwalking. I want to say yeah. Let's split up and look for him. I'm going with Zuko. What? Ooh, Everyone else she went on a life changing from trip Sokka. with Zuko. Now it's she my turn. Be home wrecker. Oh, I knew it was only a matter of time. Appa ain't Momo. <laughs> Momo, I'm coming for you, buddy. It's a help of vegetarian. That's just what Appa wants you to think. What should we do, Zuko? Ew. Uh... I don't know. <laughs> Is this Zula? Oh, wow. <laughs> That's a Zula. Why is she angry? Come on, Slowpoke, faster! You... You can't treat me like this. You can't treat me like Zuko! Azula, silence yourself. I've decided to declare you the new Fire Lord. Fire Lord Azula? It does seem appropriate. But what about you? Yeah. Just as the world will be reborn in fire, I shall be reborn as the supreme ruler of the world. From this moment on, I will be known as the Phoenix King. Oh, okay, so he's the Phoenix King. <laughs> cool, actually. And the reason you've brought us to a seedy Earth Kingdom tavern is what now? June. Oh, I thought that was gonna be his girl. Yeah, that weird bounty hunter with the giant but it wasn't. Boat. But I liked her and I missed her. No, she has what the hell is that? Just a floating island? That was a cool episode. Um, yeah, and his plan is just not. It's not it for me. It just doesn't make sense to like just wipe out every other type of bending. And only have fire bending. I guess maybe keeping the earthbenders, but just destroying their homes would be a different plan. But I feel like he wants to wipe them out like he did with the 
or his grandpa did with the um air nomads i think that's a the idea what do you guys think so we're on to part two i will see you in my next video bye guys